Come on, wake up. Wake up. Welcome to Trivia Night, a perfect storm of unholy truths. But it's also the feel-good trivia fun time hit of the summer. You'll love it. I'm going to ask you a bunch of trivia questions. If you get a question wrong, you have to fight for your life in one of my super fun mini games. If you do badly in the mini game, I'll kill you. But don't worry, ghosts can still win the game. When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round where the living and dead compete to see who can escape first. Listen to me, blabber on. Let's just get into the game. You'll figure it out as we go. First question. Which root beer contains caffeine? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Lame. Here's another one. What is the highest mountain in the Alps? said this one <laughs> everyone is wrong i want to show you something welcome to the killing floor we're going to play chalices there are eight chalices half of them are poisoned pick a chalice to drink from i'm pretty excited to show off my chalice collection to the last drop, if you know what I mean. Now let's see what everyone drank. You got poison, son. See, I wasn't joking when I said I'd kill you. I just totally killed you, but you're not getting out of this game that easily. Ghosts still get to play and can even win the whole thing in the final round. I kind of wish I were a ghost. Ah, <sighs> someday. Let's take a look at the scoreboard, shall we? Do you like it? I took an online C++ course. Aced it. Let's try another one. The hard part about making a latex Jake Gyllenhaal suit is getting the dimensions just right. According to IMDB, how tall is Jake Gyllenhaal? Who picked this one? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. I have a surprise for you. Hey girl, welcome back to the killing floor. I'm going to ask you a question. Your life depends on how you answer. What is hands down the coolest car? Type an answer on your device and press send when you're finished. Now everyone gets to vote. Pick which of these answers you hate the most. The person who wrote the answer with the most votes will die. Seriously, vote for the answer that sucks the votes are in. Ties are no fun, but it does let me punish more people. You guys are no fun. You couldn't even make it to the final round. Our education system is making my life hell. Terrible tragedy. I'd avoid that old rundown gazebo if I were you. They say terrible things happen there. A game of wits, but with this weird guy who subjected people to terrible jokes. I heard he even had writers. Terrible writers. Eight people died. Just how that old soothsayer predicted. Terrible. And now if you'll excuse me, I'm late for my old-timey accent lessons. Hi! The party's downstairs. Come on in. You 
want some more, huh? I can do this all day. Well, within reason. I have a life outside this dungeon, you know. First question. How long is a furlong? And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? The rest of you, come with me. Welcome to the killing floor. I want to see you spell. Use letters to spell the longest word you can before time runs out. I got my love for word games from my grandmother. And also my love for murder. Don't be the person with the shortest word or you'll regret it. Get to it. The letters don't have to touch each other. And remember to press submit when you're done. see what you did there. Bad spelling alert. This is going to hurt me more than it hurts you. Let's take a look at the scores. Now, don't get upset if you're in last place. Just do your best and know that you are special. But also, I will kill you, so do better. All right, next question. You know, some people think that philosophy is boring, and it can be, but if you really look, you can find an interesting aspect to any subject matter. Which of these poisons killed Socrates? <laughs> and the correct answer is this. Let's go someplace fun. Welcome back to the killing floor. Let's test your memory. Memorize the pattern. And done. I know this is a weird time to bring it up, but I just learned to play the glockenspiel. Wanna hear? That was an Alicia Keys song. Could you tell? Ah, eh, forget it. From left to right, what was the order of the weapons? And winning is its own reward, but also, if you get last place, you die, so... Good luck! the order you burned into your brain? How did you do? Wow, you all have such good memories. I won't forget this. Here's how all the scores are looking. All right, next question. What does Dwight Schrute grow on his family farm? said this <laughs> everyone is wrong prepare for your punishment good news it's math time answer as many math questions as you can before time runs out the person who does the worst 
dies. Time to get your math on. Remember to show your work. I don't know what that means, but it's fun to say. You're almost there. Math it up. Time to subtract your life. You failed at math, so now you're subtracted. Next question. British comedian Steve Coogan has been portraying which character for decades? And the correct answer is... This one? The rest of you who are still alive, you're in for a treat. Look at that! A pile of money on the floor! That's fun, right? Money! Just a huge pile of it lying there on the dirty floor. Take as much money as you want, but take the most money or the least money, and you'll be sorry. Snack some green, why don't you? See how much money everybody shoved in their pockets. Uh oh! The most greedy and least greedy must be punished. Personally, I never touch any paper money because of the germs. I've got more questions for you. This question is for all my Swifties out there. Who did Taylor Swift date first? <laughs> Who picked this one? Let's play a game. Look at this mess! There's blood all over this art! Eat your heart out, Jackson Pollock! Memorize the pattern of blood! Okay, you've had long enough. Here's a weird confession, but when I was a kid, I thought Rabbit from Winnie the Pooh was a female. I guess it's because he was a gardener and I thought all gardeners were women. Yeah, it's pretty messed up, but that's what happens when you're taught gender rules at a young age. Anyway, reproduce the pattern on your device by tapping on all the spaces that were red. Then press submit when you're done. The person who is furthest from the pattern will die. Here's that arc again. Let's see if you messed it up. Truth be told, I knew it was gonna be you. Hey, do you like the place? Originally I was gonna put a hot tub down here, but I was like, hey, you've been talking about a torture pit your whole life. You deserve it. How about this? Beware the Ides of March. Which is when exactly? <laughs> and the correct answer is... This. Hmm. 
too easy. Let's try this again. Is it just me, or is every sitcom on CBS absolutely hilarious? Who turned out to be the mother on the CBS sitcom, How I Met Your Mother? Who picked this one? Everyone again, you all need to be taught a lesson. Let's play a dice game. I'll go first. Nine. Now I need a little help from a safe player. How about you? In order to live, should they roll higher or lower? You can make it as hard or as e Way to go, Blandy McBoring choice. Roll higher than me or you die. They say you make your own luck, so make sure to blame this on yourself. <laughs> Let's try another one. If you've ever cried in a grocery store parking lot while listening to Rolling in the Deep, you should know this. What's Adele's last name? said this one let's go someplace fun it's time for some finger cutting i used to call this one knifey pointy but the name didn't test well with the focus group i kidnapped just choose one of your fingers to cut off easy right all you have to do is endure blinding pain go for it thanks for the finger food. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I don't eat them. I know where they've been. <laughs> Alright, next question. During which war was Florence Nightingale saving lives like a jerk? And the correct answer is... This. <laughs> Everyone is wrong. I have a surprise for you. <laughs> Nothing brings out the best in people like a big pile of cash. Here's how this is going to work. If no one takes the money, no one dies. But if you do take the money, I'll kill everyone who didn't. There's one catch. If you all take the money, then you all die. A little teamwork might help you get through this. <laughs> Let's see who has any kind of moral compass whatsoever. Perfect. You all got greedy, you all got dead. Everybody's dead now? Well, I guess I'll have to do this then. You have the most money, so you get one more chance. The time has come. Well, look who's still alive. Now you just have to escape with your body. I'm going to give you a category. Seven Wonders of the Ancient World. Tap on each answer that fits, then let's see the right answers. You move forward one space for every correct answer. You're getting real close to the exit. Oh, did I mention that all the other ghosts get to play too? If a ghost catches up to you, then they will steal your body. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Reptile 
dysfunction drugs. Hi! The party's downstairs. Come on in. 